Let's get started. First pay-per-view match for Knuckles Up. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Here we go. We are kicking off with one of the tallest competitors on the planet. He's all the way from Sweden, standing at six foot six. You might know him as the ambush. You might know him as the steel giraffe. Nicholas Nunnestad! Now the big steel giraffe has a tough task in front of him. He is a hometown hero, standing at six foot one. I'm talking about the one and only Jason, the fine wine. Merlo! Are you excited for this match? Uh, oh, I am. Absolutely. I have been begging and bleeding for the fine wine, Jason Malo, to come out and really take on some big opponents. This natural born killer is ready. He wants to be put out there and he is just from up the road. So he's the hometown hero there. And of course, the steel draft, six foot six, has pulled anywhere and everywhere. This has been an absolute sleeper. People need to know this match, people. I bought the pay-per-view purely for this match. Looking aggressive in this setup, I love it. It's gonna be two top rolls. They're gonna hit each other here. Can na 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 start. Can he get the start that he wants? Jason Miller wants to put his name on the map. Here we go. No, no, no. Ooh. Ooh. I'll tell you what, Merlo looked real strong there. He looked like Nanastad hit a bit of a wall. He has absolutely been Nicholas Nasted. Just a worldwide athlete, of course. One of the many awesome superstars that are here. This is the very first match, Will, of the Knuckles Up pay-per-view. Mate, exciting times. So round one. Wrist, Here we go. Ready? Ready. Go. Bang! Ooh! I'm not surprised about that whatsoever. Ooh, I heard some cracks and everything in the thumb there. That was uh, a nice little slip there. Ooh, some ninja stars going on. Right, okay. yeah. right to the straps. I knew this is where it was going to go. Uh, and it's good. So hopefully after this round, we'll go straight there. I hate all that dilly dallying around. Now, this is going to be the battle of the top rolls. Now, Nicholas with the height. What's that going to do for his advantage? I mean, if he can engage that riser at the start and climb over Jason's hand, it's a wrap. But I've pulled Jason before. Ooh. He, if anyone who knows at home, he is a fisherman at heart. And as you heard, he reels all day long. So he's going to reel that hand right back in. Absolutely. Bass kills, get the girls. Let's That's go. it. That's it, ladies. Round one. Nicholas Nasted on the left of the screen, Jason Merlot on the right. I am joined by Will Blazeski, who won his first match on the YouTube pay per view. And one of the owners of High Five Presents Knuckles Up is going to be good. Okay. Can we get the first match of the pay per view? Judy, all the way from Poland, taking control of this match. Here we go. He 
coldness, the coldness in his veins. Ice was just in there. Ooh. You get to see the Looking ring like here with absolute sniper, complete hand He's control. Done. You can see it right off the start. And he was just holding there, holding looked him. directly in him and said, I will straight have your soul. Jake, straight to the side. What an impressive win for Merlo. Finally here on the biggest stage in the United States. He's going to prove to the world what he's all about. Absolutely. I am very excited. Good start by Jason Merlo. But the one thing I like after that round one is Jason Merlo has to look directly across the table and he is looking at a worldwide athlete, Nicholas Navistat. On the left arm, a previous WL hammer holder. He is a previous WL hammer holder. I'll tell you what, you take your hammer holder and I will back in my fine wine Ooh, on the left arm. It. I would love, and I'm sure everyone on the pay-per-view would love to see these two go at it left arm because that's their strong arm as well so that'll be very interesting there i'll be keen for that but we are here on the right arm one minute sean boom hancock gives his finals we get another replay there look at all the veins there Pure jason's arm oh my god a junkie would be so jealous walking past jason going with all those veins. we're talking about the veins but i can't not help but look at the beautiful locks of hair coming off that guy's head oh, oh, looking like a I'll tell you what, man. Oh, i'm uh, very jealous not Here gonna lie go. <laughs> round two you think we're gonna see a repeat of round one all right that, he looked in full control there. The, yeah. the bandana bandit just is really just flowing those locks. Well, they didn't agree on the strap. Not surprised by that, though. So both top rollers, but now Nicholas Nunnestad just needs to hold on to that thumb, crack it. Oh, that explosive. If, if he gets the start, he could cause some trouble and pop those fingers back. Round one. Ready, go! There it is oh. there. And out they go. Very nice. Back in the strap. I'm not surprised by that. And as you can see in this replay, he's really trying to crank that low hand and just open Jason up. But I don't know if it's going to work. That clamping power, Jason, is extremely impressive. Not to mention, like we said, look at those veins, the hair, oh. the suave. He's just looking like an absolute unit tonight. He is definitely looking like a genuine unit, a stone cold to killer. Just the, I mean, everyone here in the New York, the New Jersey, the tri-state area, they know what a superstar Jason Merlot is. So let's see how he goes. So <laughs> the double hand and get these two tied together. Here we go. So we are at it there. Nicholas Nasted on the right. Jason uh, on the left. Jason Merlo on the right. Here we go. There we go. Absolute hand control. Once again, class act. I mean, can you ask for anything better? I don't know. <laughs> that was a master class. 100% Jake. He took what he needed. He waited. He's not even being fast off the go, which is honestly extremely impressive to me. He's just taking control, coming straight to the side. I don't think Nanastad was ready. He wasn't ready. He wasn't. He was it. No, he no, was not ready. Not at all. Now, the steel draft now needs to dig deep. This is a moment. Now, Nicholas Nanastad wants to get back. As you said, he was a WAL hammer holder mm -hmm. in 2016, but that was a long time and a different sort of arm wrestling ago. This is where Nicholas Nanastad now needs to look at himself and go, right, I am back in the US, but I cannot rely on previous records. I cannot rely on previous rewards, trophies, whatever. It is 2023. It is August 26th, and it is now... Now, Nicholas Nunnestad has to look somewhere deep in his soul because Jason Malone's taken bits and pieces of it. Let's hope we get some fight in round number three. As you mentioned previously, this isn't even their dominant arm. Mm. So we'll see. Maybe one day they'll pull left. But as of right now, we could be seeing a 3-0. Uh, and oh. One minute. Oh. Sean Boom Hancock gives his final things. Thank you, everyone, for joining Big Willie B, Will Blazeski, and the Aussie arm wrestler Jake Ward here on the pay-per-view. We are hanging and banging, slinging and slanging, pinning and winning out there on the table. We are loving it. And I tell you what, the crowd here are up and about. They are absolutely enjoying themselves. I'm enjoying themselves. Will's enjoying themselves. 
and I can't believe we still got four more mega matches Not coming just up. Four more matches. You said that. Say it again. Mega absolute banger of a match. Oh, it'll be absolutely crazy. Oh, there go. Go. They're back to the table. Can the steel giraffe use every bit of that six foot six frame, or is it just that absolute stone wall, the natural born killer? Jason Milo getting it. Here we go. Ready, bang! Ooh, oh, I like the aggressiveness, Jake. I think he's a little pissed off from the first two rounds. Absolutely. Absolutely pissed off for the first two rounds, and so he should be. So he should be. He's been taught a lesson, and that's very rare for Nicholas Nasted. He's always competitive in every match, and this one, it's just not looking like it. So, yeah, the aggression, the fire, the power, a lot. You, you picked it perfectly, Will, in that round. Back in the go. trap once again. Not surprised whatsoever. Let's see if Nicholas changes things up for this last one. Possible last one, I should say. Yeah, let's, let's hope we get this one into a decider. If you're just joining us on the pay-per-view, Big Will got himself a win. We also had BJ Fakakis defeat Paul Cruz. And then our last match, Zvetan Gajewski. Take a bow and a great win over Craig Tullier. Ready, go! There's a There hit. we go. Now Jason just looks at him and says, I have your hand. He is now playing. Ooh. Elbow off the front there. I'm not going to lie, that might be a saving grace for Nonestad. He gets a little restart, change up his game plan. Maybe he's going to hit a little bit harder this time. I am very impressed, though, with Merlo's hand control through this entire match. He took that hit like an absolute champ. Oh, it is just, uh, I'm impressed with Merlo's everything. I may just be developing one man crush on our man, Jason. <laughs> that is for sure. He's just looking like a complete arm wrestler against a talented opponent. Here we go. Look at that. There's the hit there, and he's given Nicholas a head start. But now he's just in full hand control, and he's going to try and rock that baby to sleep. Bang. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. Jason Merlo, Nicholas Nonestad. What an absolute amazing match. We gotta give it up to both of these athletes. Nicholas traveling all the way here from Sweden. <laughs> there we go with the timber from Jason, the fine wine Merlo. Congratulations to him. Honestly, it was oh, one hell of a match. Fine wine by name, fine wine by nature. You absolute natural born killer. Mate, what, what do we say about that pure masterclass of arm wrestling? Well, I want to take, uh, thank Nicholas for taking the match because honestly, he's a young legend in the sport. I've always looked up to him, especially at arm wars and all those types of events. This guy's a legend, so everybody give it up for him. It is uh, ridiculous. Now, I think you're going to be, you're the hometown hero. You're going to be a mainstayer at Knuckles Up. I think you have the right to start calling people out. Knuckles up two, knuckles up three. Who does Jason Malo want? Look, anybody that's above me in the rankings, there are guys that are out there that try to avoid me, try to step aside, and don't want anything to do with me. All those guys, they're next. The longer they wait, the worse it is for them. So keep waiting, keep waiting. I tell you, I am going to start becoming a fisherman because bass curls get the girls. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Jason Merlot.